Welcome back to the Raven's Hold Estate, and I, like always, am Bastion, your host. And let's see what we have in our stagecoach this week. Alright, so we definitely have some helpful people that are going to be able to be right there with us. We got an apothecary, a uh, different type of healer, blighter, uh, all around really good class. A second highwayman. Uh, we'll probably uh, get him so that we can trick one out to be melee, one out for a gunner. Elusive, evasive, persistent. Righteous traits for a rogue. All right. Uh, Gilder Sleeve here is our warrior. Uh, I like the warrior class. It is uh, pretty good at just beating down your opponents. So. That's pretty nice. A good tank. And the thrill of the hunt. The promise of payment. The same way with the Thrall here. Uh, he is a very, very good class. Uh, this is one of my favorites from Marvin Seo. So let's put him in. And we got 17 of uh, 43. So we got a little ways to go yet. Let's look, uh, Nomad Wagon. That's a good one. That one's not bad. All right, let's get everybody over here. Okay. Whoa. We we already have a boss fight that we can go to in the ruins. It's called the. Uh, we would be getting the Royal Guard, uh, plus five protection, plus ten percent healing skill, plus twenty five percent healing received. Minus 10 dodge and minus 2 crit if in position 1. This is an amazing, amazing uh, little trinket. And I don't know that I can go after it right now. But it's very good. That is very good. I'm trying to think if there's any way that I could defeat the Necromancer's Apprentice with who I've got right now. Normally I would say there'd be a chance, but because of how high the stress is on a few of my characters, I don't think I can risk it, which really sucks because that's a really good thing for a Vestal. Oh well. Uh, better to be safe than sorry sometimes. Unlike last time when I was not all that safe and I definitely got punished for it badly. So. Uh, make the Omen Seeker faster. Uh, make the Twilight Knight have a better critical. I think that'll be it. Gilder Sleeve. Come here, buddy. Or I do have a werewolf. <coughs> Excuse me. So sorry about that. Well, uh, let's go after the werewolf then. She can do everything from third position, so she'll be in third. All right. Uh, she can do the healing, which is good. And then I just need somebody else in there to be able to push through some damage. I can either do him, him, him. All right, I think I'll do it that way. Okay. Plus 20% damage. Hero was hit, all monsters. Five pure damage. Okay, and that was working last time. They were killing themselves when they were hitting Bastion, when they were hitting me. That's interesting. That is actually really, really cool to think about. That's really cool. <laughs> uh, I like that a lot. I think that is... That's just fantastic, actually. Yeah, that's... It literally sets them up to be taking 
you know, go ahead and hit me, see what happens, and they're killing themselves. That's that's pretty cool. I like that a lot. I did not actually notice it except when we were going up against the uh, the mimic, and I kept looking at its health bar. And, well, it's it's down further than it was. I thought it was glitching. No, it was it was uh, that trinket. That trinket was what was doing it. That's very good. They breed quickly down there in the dark, but perhaps we can slay them even faster. All right, I was hoping to get a scout. That didn't happen. Okay. We surprised them, though. Uh. Light. Bad. Whack. Oh, and it's dead. And I get a repost off. Sweet. Uh. Nice. Even nicer, because that kills him. And she transforms. And I got two people with repost. Okay, so he actually took... Yes, he took a grand total of seven because of who he attacked. That's really good. That's not so good. <laughs> okay. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. The apothecary took a little bit too much heat there, but other than that, that was fine. This is an amazing trinket. I'm glad I decided to go for that one instead of the other one. Ah, werewolves, go check out some books. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Such blockages are unsurprising. These tunnels predate even the earliest settlers. No? All right, that's fine. I love his design. I think that looks neat. The other one is very basic. It looks a lot like the uh, the bounty hunter. Uh, if you notice, all these skeletons pretty much look exactly the same. <laughs> but that's fine. I, I will have soldiers marching. Uh, I don't mind that at all. Kind of what it looks like. Oh! That Watch hurts. Your step. Uh, my Spartan, go and get some more extra food. Oh, no, you didn't. You got a buff. 30% damage. I like it. Well, let's get it for you now. <laughs> yeah, there we go. There we go, there we go. I like it, I like it. In Radiance, may we find victory. All right, there'll be a battle here. Surprise? No. Uh, blight them. Precision Very nice. Power. You know, I could be wrong, but throwing up on her, I think, would be a very poor idea. Alright. Alright, so that'll take him out. I don't know that you really want to do what... Yeah, I don't think you want to do that. Nice dodge. Bam. Alright, so she's going to go into the repost mode. We're going to keep poisoning her. Yeah. So she just killed herself. Yep. So she just died. <laughs> Destroy them all. That's very interesting. All right. Nice. 
This is definitely a movie group. I didn't even realize that when I made it. But they're moving around and they're doing fine. A lot of that has to do with the fact that they have driven into the mud. So many reposts. So oh we got some gear here. Oh here we go. Uh belly protection. That's from the big pig. Plus twenty percent protection. Wow. Uh plus thirteen percent stress. Well, whatever. On attack, miss, debuff self, minus two speed. Curse to exist. Uh, so if we have another one of these, then we get a plus 13 death blow resist and minus 25% stress. Okay. Uh, let's, let's go ahead and put that on my, my guy here. That's not bad. I mean, you have to be a little bit aware of what's going on. Uh, so far, this game has been a lot luckier than the last one. Uh, that last one, it was just, it was rough. Okay. So he just did five. Oh, that does five damage to all of them. Oh. Okay. Is broken. It's better than I thought it was. Wow. Okay, that's a lot better than I thought it was. Huh. Okay then. Interesting. Ah, that killed him too. Victories mount, so too will resistance. Well, all right then. I knew that was a strong trinket. I did not realize it was that strong of a trinket. Well, that's an amazing trinket to start out with. All monsters, pure five damage. Wow, okay. I'm going to have to give that to a individual and just let him keep it because it's just too powerful otherwise the froggle bun witch everyone the over is powered broken. trinket A blazing star is born <laughs> wow go oh yeah this is definitely a moving group the uh, apothecary stays back here we're good to go though oh nice dodge and they oh wow wow I was really hoping you'd go after him. Green ears, blurred vision, the end approaches. Uh, you're dead already. There you go. Bam! Hit him with the hammer. Out of way, Robert Baratheon. All right. All right. No wow. Unforeseen. Unforgiving. I thought I was going to get another trinket. I've been getting a ton of them so far. Wow. Okay. Uh, da, 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 da. All right. Good. We still got one left. Lots of food. That's good, because I need to eat a little bit of it. Froggle Bunwich. Oh. Oh. 
Are you bleeding? Curious is the trap maker's art. His efficacy unwitnessed by his own eyes. Uh. Glittering gold, trinkets and baubles, paid for in blood. As the light gains purchase, spirits are lifted, and purpose is made clear. Okay. Surprise, wonderful. I need to put this on a guy who marks himself. And then just have the enemy kill themselves. <laughs> All right. Oh. No. Okay. Hey, at least they're smart enough not to be going after this dude. Dodge? No. There's a dodge. And that'll kill his buddy and him. I think I just wiped them all out. Nope, not quite. Success so oh, clearly and okay. Clear. So we're Or is it merely a trick of the light? This is definitely a different game entirely than the last one because the last one we were not getting any of these trinkets. This time we are getting a ton of trinkets. So Alright. Uh this and this is gonna go with the other one actually pretty well. Uh plus twenty percent damage if marked, ten percent accuracy if marked. Plus twenty five percent stress if not in pers uh, if not in position one, and thirteen percent stress. Now, if I put this over here on this, then we're going to notice something interesting about when you put it together. Uh, altogether, you'll get minus twenty five percent stress. Both of these increase it by thirteen, so that's a total of twenty six percent stress you're going to take, minus twenty five. So you're going to be doing an additional 1% stress when anything happens. Just 1%. And then you have a 13% death blow resist. So that means you have a tendency to hang around. Uh, this one's if afflicted, and that's the, the opponent is marked. You can just imagine when you start combining these cursed trophies together how much pain you can inflict. All right, let's see what I can ditch here so I can get this trinket because this is actually a very good trinket for the Scourge sometimes. <laughs> uh, pa -pa 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 -pa. Let's, let's do that. Yeah, I have already read that. Okay. All right. So we are definitely getting some very interesting stuff here. If I had any Mark Synergy whatsoever, I would have given it to him. But I don't think any of us... And we've been killing it so fast, it's not really been that important. Yeah, I can mark her. I can clear Mark Target. Yeah, I can clear Mark Target. Can you mark anybody? No. Okay, that's fine. And I don't think you have a mark. No, you do not have a mark. All right, that's that's perfectly fine. Uh, just helps clear it up. Packs laden with loot are often low on supplies. That way, I don't have uh, it in this inventory. This should be the last fight, I believe. Oh, this is uh, it's been a pretty good little group here. This is the Froggle Bunwitch group right here, let me tell you. Nice. Alright. 
Yeah, all right, that did. works. Nice dodge. Okay. Nice dodge. Uh, let's go ahead and heal you. Stab you. Cut you. Then you're going to repost. We're going to uppercut here. So now we got two reposts. Uh huh. And that repost has a bleed attached to it, so. There we go. And thunk. Very nice. Seize this momentum. Push on to the task's end. I have to be careful because I'm not 100% sure this is the last one. Let's go with that. Alright. It is. Okay. That was fun. Um, we got a ton of trinkets. Some experiments should have never happened. You are doing just work ending them. Now, when I started this game over, or when I started this game, oh, that's horrible. Uh, I did not do anything to make the trinkets more. A wash in blood and delusion. More he bears the burden of a thousand lifetimes more available. Uh, I just tried to make sure that there were not as many glitches. Uh, that is a glitch in my favor that I'm not going to complain too much about if it's a glitch. Uh, I don't know. I think it just might be luck for a change because that is very lucky. <laughs> so we just got to power in the blood for those with the fortitude to pay the price. So we got a ton of trinkets there. We got a Scourge Trinket, a Crusader Trinket, uh, Highwayman, no, it was, uh, Arbalist, that one, that one, so, I mean, we got quite a few trinkets there. That was a lot of luck. Like I said, I hope it was luck. <laughs> I don't want any more glitches. All right, but that will do it for this episode at the Raven's Hold Estate. I hope you have enjoyed. If you have, please feel free to come back to Ravenshold. Until then, have a great day.